it's time for the greatest athleticism you've ever seen in your life. The professionals are quaking in their boots. With the many videos out there of people that excel in their sport, there's a series as it is now time to watch me suck at bowling. Welcome to week four or five for the month of October and watch me suck at bowling. Coming to you from what is now the season premiere location, now that there's a season premiere, New Palace Lanes, Fitchburg, Massachusetts. Home of King of the Palace. And it is September 29th as this is being recorded and it's mixed doubles. And I gotta say this because Dave will throw it in my ear if I don't. It's the seventh season of King of the Palace. And speaking of King of the Palace, Watch Me Suck at Bowling is proud to sponsor the hit Candlepin TV show, King of the Palace. Instead of watching this garbage, watch people that actually can bowl. <laughs> Go to, just type in King of the Palace in the YouTube search bar and watch to heart's content. And if you like what you see, go to youtube.com slash new palace lanes. Hit that subscribe button. Hit the notification bell. That way, YouTube won't screw you out of videos that you've been waiting for. And I'm getting better at this promo. We are bowling on lane number five. The TV show is done on three and four. Those are sacred. Those are off limits. Frankly, no one would want me bowling on that before a show. Anyway, so far we have done okay, except for that, that, that. Oh wow, this thing actually pin cushions if I get close enough. I've had this ca camera for several years and didn't know that. 97, 109, and then episode one ends with a 70. And then we got a 98 and a 101. So what will game four be like? Will it be good? Will it be better? Will it suck? There's only one way to find out. Frame one, ball one. Nice pitch. How does that happen? <laughs> <laughs> That's the roundabout way of getting 10. And for those of you who like the pin setters, here's the bull more in action. And there you go. Frame two, ball one. Two. Not bad for a half Worcester ball, which I believe the halfway point between here and Worcester is Miola's ice cream and Sterling. I tell people I'm going to do a series of where is half Worcester. I got to do it at some point. <laughs> Bowling God's middle finger remains for now. So far, not a bad start yet again. Got a 10 and 1, 9 and 2. So far, a fairly healthy 19. Frame 3, ball 1.
Ball two. Ball pin fell at the last minute. Hope my head wasn't blocking it. Ball three. Ten. Frame four by one. Ball two. Ball three. Six is better than the alternative. Things didn't go quite well. We got the 10 and 3, but then a 6 and 4. So far, 35. Still not too bad. Frame 5, ball 1. Ball 2. Nine pins wobbling, but uh, not going. Ball three. When you you And seven. Frame six, ball one. Ball two, Sam Sitar. That was a helicopter pin. There we go, finally a mark. Once again, a mixed bag. We got a fair seven and five. Then we got a spare in six. So far we have a 52 with El Stinko the bonus ball to come. Frame seven, ball one. El Stinko the bonus ball. What will the bonus be? El Stinko, ha ha ha. Well, outside of three games in episode one and the other three games, that's the first true El Stinko of one. <laughs> ball two. Ball three, I got robbed of redemption. Eight. Frame eight, ball one. Ball two. David Letterman on the left. Ball three. I think the Palace Gods are awake again. This could be the worst stink frame of the day. And the bowling gods are telling me something. Like the middle finger for them. Well, the spare wasn't too good. We got an eight and seven, 
but the first ball was only a one, making the fill. And then we got a nine and eight. So far, 70. This could be a good game. Frame nine, ball one. We might hit bottom end of average, which is okay with me. As I say in Spanish, El Spero. Last frame, ball one, El Stinko. This could be redemption. Nope, El Stinko lift up to its name. It's a four, eight, that's a two. Ball two. Right through the hoop with no grease. <laughs> How does that happen? Ball three, let's not end this one in a whimper. Well, the typical end, a terrible ending. Stink frame of four. Per usual, everything ends poorly. We got a spare in nine, and then a four in ten. Half of that making the fill. But at least it was a halfway decent game of 86, and came so close to the high triple of 314, but not enough. There were a couple of bad frames, like frame four with the six, and of course 10 with the four, and both fills with El Stinko living up to its name, those don't help either. That will wrap up week four of five for the month of October 2018 for Watch Me Suck at Bowling. This is George F551 saying hope you enjoyed and have a good one.